that went like this. B A B A B E B B I Bicky by B O Bo Bicky by Bo B U Boo Bicky by Bo Boo. Do you remember that at all? All right, and the notes for it went B A B A B E B B I Bicky by B O Bo Bicky by Bo B U Boo Bicky by Bo Boo. Yes, I know, nonsense, complete nonsense. Actually, have you ever heard of the Three Stooges? They did a really funny version of this song way, way, way back when. Well, we're gonna use it as a warm up again today, but let's practice it really slowly and then we'll do it with some music and work on speeding it up. Here we go. B A B A B E B. You try that part. Ready, go. B A B A B E B. Good. The next part. B I B I K I B I B O B O B I K I. Ready? B I B I K I B I B O B O B I K I. And then B I B O B I U B O B I K I B I B O B O. Your turn. B I B O B I U B O B I K I B I B O B O. Yes, lots of nonsense. Let's see if we can put it all together, nice and slow. Here we go. B A B A B E B B I B I K I B I B O B O B I K I B I B O B U B O B I K I B I B O B O. You've got it. A little faster. Here we go. B A B A B E B. B I B I K I B I B O B O B I K I B I B O B U B O B I K I B I B O B O. All right, I think you're ready to try it with the music. We start about that speed and get a little faster as we go. Here we go. B A B A B E B B I B I K I B I B O B O B I K I B I B O B U B O B I K I B I B O B O. Good again, little faster, and 
Chester, have you heard about Harry? Just got back from the army. I hear he knows how to wear a rose hip hip hooray for the army. Little faster yet, here we go. Chester, have you heard about Harry? Just got back from the army. I hear he knows how to wear a rose hip hip hooray for the army. Woo wee! Good Would job. You please be my echo. So la, so so me. So me, me, re, do. Do, la, so, do, do. Do, re, mi, mi, re, do. Do, la, so, do, do. Do la so so la do. Do re mi so so mi. So mi do so do. Great job. Now for a challenge, I'm going to be showing you the hand signs without me singing them just showing you the hand signs, then I'm going to have you try to sing it, and I will then sing it with you to check your answer. So do your very best. I'm going to make them pretty simple patterns. Just give it a try. Be brave. Here's the first one. Looks like this. Ready, sing. Should have sounded like so me. Should have sounded like do, la, so, do. Good, last one looks like this. Ready, try it. Should have sounded like do, re, mi, so, so, so. All right, good job starting to try to figure that out. It's tricky to use our inner hearing to start to think through the notes and then sing them out loud and check ourselves. But great job with that. Thank you so much for joining us today. I hope you enjoy the rest of your lesson. I'd like to start teaching you a song called Olele Moliba Makasi. It's from the Democratic Republic of the Congo, and it's a song in the language of Lingala, which is one of the main dialects in the Democratic Republic of Congo, and this song is sometimes used as a lullaby, and if you go on YouTube, there are several versions of it as a kid's song used as a lullaby. And then, also, it can be used as a rowing song because the song is about two rivers in the Democratic Republic of Congo, the Olele and the Kasai. And, so, and then we talk about this current called Benguela. Say Benguela. Yeah, it's a cold current off of the coast of Southwest Africa, and it can bring really strong winds with it too. So that's in our song. Our song says, Olele, Olele, the current is very strong. So that's the river. The Olele River, the current is very strong. Ro, Ro, his country is the Kasai, which is another river. And then we sing, Eh, let Benguela come. Let these cold, this cold current, all of these winds come. And then we say, Olele, Olele, the current is very strong. So will you please be my echo? Olele, olele. Your turn. Good. Olele, olele. Good. Now I'm going to add to it. Listen carefully. Olele, olele. Moli ba makasi. Your turn. Olele, olele, moliba makasi. Good 
job. Good job. So let's try that line again, because we're going to sing it two times in a row whenever we do sing it. Here we go. Ole, le, ole, le, mole, ba, ba, ka, si. Ole, le, ole, le, mole, ba, ma, ka, si. Great work. So that's our first line. And then our second line goes, it's a little tricky because the M and the B happen fast and kind of make the same sound. So it goes, boca, boca. Can you try that? Boca, yeah. Boca, na, ye, boca, boca, kasai. Listen again. Boca, na, ye, boca, boca, kasai. Your turn. Boca, na, ye, boca, boca, kasai. Again. Boca, na, ye, boca, boca, kasai. Yeah, good job. So let's try our first two lines together. The more we repeat it, the easier it will get. Isn't it a beautiful song? I really like it and it's been stuck in my head since I have been learning it to teach it to you. One, two from the beginning and ole le, ole le, mole ba ma ka si. Ole le, ole le, mole ba ma ka si. Boca na ye, boca boca ka si. Okay, the next part, it almost sounds like it doesn't fit to the song, but this is the part that means, go ahead, let that cold current come. So it kind of sticks out in the middle of the song like a cold current would stand out in the middle of a really beautiful warm river. So I wonder if when they wrote it, that's what they were intending. Well, listen how it goes. It goes, e -o, e -o, Well, will you be my echo? Let's try the A-O part. A-O, A-O, your turn. A-O, A-O, good. Benguela, aya, your turn. Benguela, aya. Good, let's try it all together. Here we go. A-O, Can you tell me the section that you think? So we have three sections, right? We've got ole le, and then we have our boca, boca na ye, boca, boca kasai. We have that part. And then we have our e yo, e yo, benguela aya. So in either of those three parts, where do you think you could have heard a low la? Because remember, that would be the lowest note we would hear in the whole song. If you said on the benguela aya, you're right. That is our la 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 do la. Can you sing that with me? Here we go. La 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 do la. Good again. La 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 do la. That's right. We have a low la sticking in the middle of this song. Okay. I think you can try it from the beginning. All of our three sections together. Let's give it a try. And then maybe next time we'll be able to add some rhythms to it, some rhythmic patterns or percussion too. 
One, two, here we go. Ole, le, ole, le, moli, ba, ma, ka, si. Ole, le, ole, le, moli, ba, ma, ka, si. Boka, na, ye, boka, boka, ka, sa, yi. Boka, na, ye, boka, boka, ka, sa, yi. job singing along in Lingala, that Democratic Republic of Congo language, and hopefully filling in those claps and snaps where we did. Uh, I really enjoyed singing that with you. I can't wait to do it again and try to add something else more exciting to it. I have a fun movement song to teach you. So you could be sitting or standing, either one is fine. See if you can figure out what goes with what in this song. Bim bum bim bum biddy biddy bum biddy bum biddy biddy bum bim bum bim bum bim bum biddy biddy bum biddy bum biddy biddy bum bim bum bim bum biddy biddy bum biddy bum biddy biddy bum bim bum bim bum biddy biddy bum biddy bum biddy biddy bum bim bum I know it probably sounds like a lot of nonsense to you and some of you older grades you might recognize this song because we have done it before so do you remember how it works all right when we sing bim where do we go every bim is a pat that's right bim what about bomb all the bombs are snaps and biddy is a clap but it's not two claps it's not biddy it's just keeping the beat so it goes Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum. Can you try that with me? Here we go. Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum. Again. Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum. Good job. The next part goes. Biddy bum, biddy biddy bum, bim bum. Ready? Biddy bum, biddy biddy bum, bim. Good news is we repeat, so we go back to the beginning. Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum, biddy bum, biddy biddy bum, bim bum. The only difference is the melody notes change, right? And we go lower the second time around. So let's try this whole first section and see if we can do it together. We'll stay nice and slow. Ready, sing. Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum, biddy bum, biddy biddy bum, bim bum. Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum, biddy bum, biddy biddy bum, bim bum. How'd that go? You get the hang of it? Good. Let's do that section one more time. Here we go. Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum, biddy bum, biddy biddy bum, bim bum. Bim bum, bim bum, biddy biddy bum, biddy bum, biddy biddy bum, bim bum. Yeah, very good. Here's the second section. Here we go. Let's try the second section nice and slow. You can be my echo first. It goes like this. 
Good job. Let's try that whole second section all together. Here we go. Bim, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, biddy, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, bim, bum. Bim, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, biddy, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, bim, bum. Yeah, that's it. You ready to try it from the beginning? Nice and slow and steady. Here we go. Bim, bum, bim, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, biddy, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, bim, bum. Repeat. Bim, bum, bim, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, biddy, bum, biddy, biddy, bum, bim, bum. Go up high. Are you ready to try it just a little faster? Let's try it one more time, just a little faster for those folks who know it. If you don't know it yet and you're just learning it, you can try your best or just watch if you need to. That's okay. Or just sing along and get to know the song even better. Here we go. Bim, bum, bim, bum. our mystery song. So we have the rhythm here. We're going to read it and see if we can figure out what song this could be. This little curved line right here is called a tie. It would normally hold these two notes together. For now we're going to skip over it just so we can practice reading our tadimis and takadis correctly. One, two, ready, go. Tadimi tadi, tadimi tadi. Ta di mi ta ka di ta di ta. And we have this symbol here, which is a repeat sign. So in the song, this pattern happens two times through. So let's say and clap it two times in a row. Ready, go. Ta di mi ta di, ta di mi ta di, ta di mi ta ka di ta di ta. Ta di mi ta di, ta di mi ta di. Ta di mi ta ka di ta di ta. All right, sometimes it can be hard to figure it out while you're the one saying it. So I will say and clap it for you, or actually I'm just gonna clap it for you. But I'm not gonna say the rhythm, I want you to just hear how it goes and see if that helps you recognize our song. Listen carefully. And I did do the tie that time to help you out because when you hear the song, you probably would recognize it like that. Listen again. Can you recognize what it is? I'll give you a hint. We haven't sung this song. We've only moved to this song. Any ideas? Listen one more time and this time I'll sing the rhythm. Ta di mi ta di ta di mi ta di ta di mi ta ka di ta di ta. Ta di mi ta di ta di mi ta di ta di mi ta ka di ta di ta. Did you get it? It's Cesare Ie, our dance from. 
the Torres Strait Islands. So hop up out of your chair, be ready to move, and do the dance with me. Great job helping to read the rhythm for Cesar Ie and figure out what song it was that we were reading. Since we read the rhythm for it, now we have got to do the dance. So stand up and be ready to move with me. So we have a new song today. It's called Hogs in the Cornfield. And it goes, Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. Can you help me out this time? I want you to listen for where the cows are. Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. Where were those cows at? Oh, in the clover. All right, so who was the sister? Let's see. Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. Hmm. Did you figure out that her name was Kate? And we were telling her that we're going to come over. Can you help me out with those first two parts? Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over, and I'll do the rest. Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, ha. Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. That was your part. Let's see if you can do it. Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. How do we know that those cows were in, how do we know that those hogs were in the cornfield? We met a little boy and he told us so. So, hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Can you add that into your part? You got hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield. How do you know? And I've got the very last part. Met a little boy and he told me so. so. Let's see if we can do that. Ready and go. Hogs. 
Met a little boy and he told me so. Can you add that part in? Met a little boy and he told me so. So you have the whole thing this time. Can you help me sing? Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. Now, we have a game to go with this. So, have you ever played rock, paper, scissors? I bet you have. So, we're going to go rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three, shoot. And on the word shoot, we're going to show either rock, beats scissors, and scissors beats paper, but paper covers the rock. So paper actually beats rock. So if I win, I get a point. If you win, you get the point. Let's see. Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. Rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three, shoot. Showing paper. Did I beat you? If I did, I get the point. If you're not, you get the point. Let's try again. Ready and go. Hogs in the corn till cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the corn till how do you know? Not the little boy and he told me so. Rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three, shoot. Going scissors. Did you beat me? I hope so. If not, I get the point. Let's try again. Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield, cows in the clover. Now your sister Kate, we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. Rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three, shoot. Oh, I showed paper that time. Did I cover you? Did I win? I got finger. Did I? If I did, I get one point. If you didn't, if I didn't, you get the point. <sighs> Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield. Huh? Ready and go. Hogs in the cornfield. Cows in the clover. Tell your sister Kate we're coming over. Hogs in the cornfield, how do you know? Met a little boy and he told me so. Rock, paper, scissors, one, two, three, shoot. I kept rock. Did you win or did I? I wonder how many people I beat. Maybe you can comment and tell me if you won. So I will see you later and great job on that.